Electricity. We cannot live without it. But at what cost? Electricity prices are always rising, even more so in the last two years, where they've risen by nearly 400%. Reducing our electricity consumption is the most effective way to mitigate this rise. But how do we do this aside from living like we're in the 16th century? It's less about reducing our usage of electrical appliances and more about using those appliances more efficiently and crucially, not wasting energy. So how are we wasting energy at the moment? The measured UK average voltage supplied is around 242 volts. However, all the appliances we use run most efficiently at 220 volts. This means that any side that operates on an incoming voltage above 220 volts is wasting energy which we know costs more money up front, but is also subject to higher maintenance costs due to a high or unhealthy voltage level. Here's a quote from an electrician's guide which exemplifies this wastage. A filament lamp rated at 230 volts, used at 240 volts, will achieve only 55% of its rated life. So by cutting the excess voltage, we can cut our energy consumption by up to 12%. This is voltage optimization. So there are two ways we can drop the voltage of an appliance. Here's the voltage of our appliance before any optimization. Now the first way is to use a fixed step-down transformer, which means you can reduce the voltage by a fixed amount. So for example, by 8%. Unfortunately though, this has several disadvantages. The incoming voltage to an appliance fluctuates constantly during the day. As seen here, fluctuating from 250 to 245 volts. This means that the fixed transformer will only save maximum energy when the incoming voltage is at 245 volts. When the incoming voltage is at 250 volts, for example, you will be missing out on significant savings. More importantly, if the incoming voltage is down to 220 volts, the fixed transformer will now be supplying an unhealthy voltage to your appliance. The second way of reducing your voltage usage, and the considerably better way, is to use our iVolt. The iVolt is a digital precision stabilizer. This means it will reduce the voltage from any level by a maximum of 12%, but ensuring the output will never drop below 220 volts. It pins the voltage at 220 volts, providing maximum savings at all times. So how can we monitor our iVolt's performance to make sure we're actually saving energy? The iVolt has a unique performance tracker called Intelligent Real-Time, or IRT for short, which makes it the only voltage optimizer in the world that can report accurate energy-saving readings in real time. The IRT uses an algorithm of comparing consumption while on voltage optimization with consumption when not on optimization to find the true consumption and then saves these readings on its bespoke portal in the cloud so that you can see what savings you are making. The iVolt is available in many different solutions, from small commercial to large industrial applications. We're trusted by global brands to save them thousands on energy prices. For example, since 2015, we have saved the Dumfries and Galloway Council 187,000 kilowatt hours per year running their ice rink, which translates to 56,000 pound savings per annum. And that's before the recent significant rise in energy prices. For more examples and case studies of companies we've helped save energy over the decade that we've been supplying iVolt, visit our website, solitech.com.